the burden of hearing loss in Uganda is actually very high. And all these studies I've listed here have actually been done here in Uganda, in various parts of Uganda. We have a study that was done in adults showing 11% of all adults having hearing impairment. Another study in among children from 6 to 12 years showing 7.4% when they're HIV positive and 3.8% if they're negative, having hearing problems. Um, children aged 6 months to 5 years, 33% if HIV positive had a problem with their hearing. Even another study in infants aged 1 day to 3 months showed that for every 1,000 children born, 12 had a problem with hearing impairment. When we detect hearing loss early, we are able to prevent it early, treat it early and prevent the burden that comes with having a child who can't hear, they can't communicate, they, they lag behind in school. This could be through um, establishing hearing screening programs. Number two could be to employ audiologists and uh, speech pathologists at the regional referral hospital so that we eliminate the idea of everyone needs to go to Kampala to get these services. We need to bring these services closer to the people. We intend to roll out uh, a research program that is going to help us identify hearing problems in uh, children or infants. We are trying to introduce it so that it can later become policy. As children come in at immunization sites or wellness clinics that say because children who come in at immunization sites are always healthy and okay, but we need to know if actually these children have issues with their hearing.